Hello people, and today I'm going to be talking about couch tea, well, show tasting couch tea. So, what is couch tea? Couch tea is a fork of mist tea. It uses activity pub, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I think I've already said the little intro bit there. So what, what why couch tea? Why would you want to use couch tea over Mastodon Twitter? You know, anything else? Well, I mean, if I'm being honest, even though I'm not a massive fan of modern new eyes, this looks so much better than Mastodon. Can I just say that? Let me just show you like my profile. Look. Look at that. That's like so much better. Like, look at that. It runs, you know, smoothly as well. Um, you know, you've got all of your cool features. It's just, you know, in this better form. You might be like, oh, okay, it looks all cool and what? What's the features? Well, first off, you've got edible widgets on the side. You can add them, you can remove them. I've never actually really... Um, oh, wait. I've never really actually properly fiddled with it, but... It could add, you know, all these cool things. It could add um, a button even, just a button. And then you can make it do something, presumably. Like this is just saying, hello world, cool. So if I hit done, it'll give me a pop-up saying, hello world, bing. Yeah. But of course you've got more options than that, it's just on boring who goes for the defaults. Okay, cool. Right, yeah, that's everything. Goodbye people. Thanks for watching. And yeah, see you later. Bye. No, of course not. Of course there's more to this than that. So you've got a three thousand character limit. Well, Actually, no, it's a customizable amount. It depends on what server, but the main server just has 3000. So if I just filled that up, you know, okay, oh no, I've gone over the limit. Oh well, let's delete a bit, you know. Oh, look at that, it's a bunch of nonsense. But you get the point, you've got plenty of characters to play with. So you've got polls. Now you might think, oh, polls, how, how innovative. But guess what? You can have like 9 billion options. Is it 10? Yeah, 10. I was thinking that. And you can allow it to select multiple choices. You can even make it never end if you want. You know? Mastodon definitely doesn't have this many choices. Um, you've got hiding content, mention, hashtags, emoji, you know, all cool and wall. But, like, what's the point? Well, guess what? You can view, hover, and you get previews. Amazing. Why is this feature not in Mastodon? It's in Twitter, but not Mastodon. Last time checked, and I'm pretty sure it still hasn't changed. Previews. How simple is that? Now you've got more stuff. You've got a fancy UI, you know. Also, you've got all these settings here. Oh, look, I can have this. I can have, you know, my location. I can have my birthday on here. Oh, yes, the best feature you might have not noticed. It's the cat ears. Seriously, this is the best thing ever. I know it's from Miss Key, but it still carries over. And it's amazing. Absolute genius. Okay, cool. It has sounds. You have sounds for your notifications. Your, all sorts of stuff here, as you can see. 
you've got a status bar that you can add. You might be like, oh, what's the point of a status bar? Oh, blah, 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 what on earth is it supposed to do? You can have ISS, Federation, or do Federation, just because it all shows stuff up here. No offence, but I'm not sure necessarily what the point of this is, but for RSS, you know, I can understand. So, yeah. What does the coloured do? I don't know. But, yeah. You, know, you can make it reverse. You can change the speed. Yeah. Uh, Yeah, you know, have it like that. You get the point. You can have nav. You can customize the navigation bar. So if you don't use mm, channels, what's the channel? I don't actually know. This. Then the answer is, uh, I don't. Know. You can just get rid of it from your bar. Oh, that's useless. Boom. See. Save and then you'll apply after page reload. Um, okay, what's bookmarks? I don't know. You might want to get rid of it, so it might be like, Oh, where's my bookmarks? I guess it'll be if you favorites, right? Okay, maybe I should do a um, little issue on the calc key, of course. For that, because that should really just match up. Same with messaging, just make it match up. We've got follow requests. Uh, no. So I could just have it like this because I don't really use, I've never used the chat feature. I don't really use Explore if I'm being honest. In fact, I don't really use the sidebar. The, well, it's the sidebar, it's the navigation bar. At all, if I'm being honest, it's only really for search. You know, I've got my notifications on the side, what most am I supposed to be? Not really much. Of course, you've got themes, like, you've got light one. I, it's always weird seeing it, because I've pretty much always just used dark. You can change your theme in dark, so what's I mean, it just makes it a bit brighter. Me, dark. A of these. Okay. Uh, you can still themes make theme, you know, everything. Um, you can change the device type if you really wanted. Uh, sure. Or you can display the posting form at the top of the timeline, like that. If you really wanted, you know. It's an option. It's customizable. I'm not even going to go that deep into the customization options. But yeah, oh yes, there's also one cool feature that I think needs pointing out. Drive, you might think, oh, what's Drive? Essentially, all the images and files you upload using your posts get sent here. Why is it not loading, I'm not sure. However, I promise you, it's a cool feature once it ever loads. Okay, I'm gonna go into reactions. You can have reactions on people's posts. So you can have as many reactions as possible. Well, well okay. Um, you can have some options. It's not like it at all now. I promise you, it is still really good. It is a bit broken here for some reason. But yeah, I promise you, it's the most coolest things. So you've got drive, you've got email, whatever that does. Oh yeah, it's just your email address and then you can get email notifications, integration, blah, blah, blah. Okay, cool, but this isn't Mastodon, and therefore I'm not able to use Mastodon apps. The answer is you're technically kind of correct, but however, the answer is not quite anymore, or not quite on this instance. Because there is now experimental Mastodon API support. So if I just hit login and I do i.calpkey.cloud, I'll be able to log in using here. Or I should be able to. 
So this is the thing, it's a bit unreliable on this stuff, but right, I promise you I have managed to do it before. Okay? I don't. I promise you it is but to be fair it's experimental so of course it's gonna be a bit drinking. But yeah. I honestly don't understand why previews aren't being listed on. And they've also got more stuff if you want any of these go for it. You can add them presumably. Layout, what does layout do? You got the deck, you know, like your um thingy. So if you wanted a better way to view your posts, then you've probably found it there. I've never really thought about it. Okay. Okay, it's a bit broken this deck, no offence. It's not really something I'd necessarily want to use. But oh well. Well uh, by that I mean I wouldn't mind using it if it wasn't a bit dodgy, let's say. But it's a feature. You can have it if you want. But yeah. How do I get to deck? Now, yeah, so you've got classic, which is just your classic style. Oh, I didn't actually know this existed. Oh, I actually prefer this. Oh, this is much better. Notifications. Um, calendar, that's the default. And then you could have your hashtags. Um, trending. This is what you get for using help. You get the best customization features ever. Boom. You can have your calculator key to look like this. It's amazing. I love how compact this is. Well, okay. It's a bit... If you want a layout that's even more like Twitter... Really, this is it. Oh my god, this is amazing. Okay. Watch me find 5 billion more features. But in other words, I do generally prefer this over Mastodon. Um, yeah. See you later. Goodbye, people.